So I figured, while I'm still on a roll, I'd take a look at another Power Ranger game. This time, it's the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers for the Super Nintendo. Now this game doesn't really have the nostalgic factor for me like the movie game does. I never really played this one as a kid, but that doesn't change the fact that it's a pretty damn good game. It's another side-scrolling beat-em-up, only this time it's only on one plane. Now in the movie game you could move up and down, left and right, pretty much in all directions. This one, it's only back and forth. You pick your ranger and fight your way through each level, starting as the teen without their power suits, until about midway through each level, then you get your suit. You have your standard punches, throws, weapon attacks, nothing too fancy when it comes to moves, except you do have a screen filling special move when you're a ranger. While it is a very simplistic game, it is still fantastic. With that said, it is also very frustrating. There are some nice swimming and platforming sections thrown in, but wall jumping can really get annoying. Now basically the key to wall jumping in this game is not to try and time it. That was my issue. I kept trying to time my button pushes when basically all you have to do is button mash the jump button. The boss battles, while interesting, can be pretty annoying too. Someone had a hard on for teleporting bosses, so pretty much everyone besides maybe maybe two spend most of the battle teleporting around. The game looks fantastic, the music is awesome, and while the game can get pretty annoying, I enjoyed it and I beat it in one sitting. It took me about two and a half hours. You fight your way through each level, eventually reaching the final battle on the moon where you pilot a Megazord and fight this one dude. Now he's in a couple games and I have no idea who he is. I don't remember him from the show so I have no idea who this is. But anyway, the Megazord fight is actually pretty cool. You have to wait for your power to grow and the longer you wait, the stronger special attacks you can perform. I think there was a Godzilla fighting game with a similar mechanic, but uh, don't quote me. You beat him, he transforms into his final form, and then you beat him again. In a pretty hard fought battle, I died quite a few times fighting this guy. Uh, you beat him, the teens are shown zooming around the beach in a convertible, the Black Ranger dances around like a fucking madman. The credits roll, and game number two is beaten.